I think most people don't live their full potential. First of all, because they've never been told their full potential, that they are sons of God and daughters of God. Um, you know, Nicholas of Cusa, one of the medieval um, philosophers, he called God possibility itself. That was his definition of God, possibility itself. Uh, I think when you're not in touch with possibility itself, you live a very cramped, tiny, petty life. When you just live out of the small self, the imperial ego, the little me, you, you don't get very far. You just protect your own, you know, turf. You live behind your own little white picket fence. And that self is inherently fearful. It can't be anything else. The small self is fear-based, is shame-based, and it should be because, because it isn't the true self. Do you, you follow me? Huh? Yeah. You see this uh, picture behind me where we're gonna use it in our um, true self, false self conference next month. And one reason we like to use this is because we see the, the false self finally embracing the true self and the tremendous fruitfulness and fertility that comes from that. Uh, but most of us live out of illusion and therefore we don't, uh, uh, you know, you live behind your, your white picket fence, uh, protecting this little thing that doesn't even have any objective grounding. It's not worth protecting. <laughs> you know, Thomas Merton said it so well. He said, one thing for sure about heaven, there won't be much of you there. And, and, and this little you, this little I, this little Richard in this case, is the very thing that everybody puts all their energy into protecting and it's gonna die. It's gonna be over and gone in a few years. And this is only the, the vehicle for the vision. This is only you know, the, the encasement through which I become a part of the universal mystery. But if I spend all my life protecting this casing, what a waste of time. That's most people I know, I'm ashamed to say. And the giveaway for that is when you take offense real easily, when you're hurt real easily. You know when you're hurt real easily, you're living out of the small self. Because this little self here is very hurtable. The true self in God, you can't hurt it. It's, it's unhurtable.